I know it is, isn't it? Yeah. How are you? I'm okay. Good. Just getting outside my brain. Didn't have any glance through the window. Nah. <laughs> Hi, Ben. Now I'm not sure I want to be in there. Now I can't see anything when. Smile, you're on camera. What in there? Is that what you said? Did that one still get caught on something other than, yeah, the top of the little. I might need to come up a little bit more. Got a lot. Turn that around. Fix that problem. Alright. I'm really interested to see what's going to happen when I get to the second the layer. Level. Should work though. I basically programmed 10 positions and then I'm doing a surface find. So far, it's, it's, uh, it's only got a limitation. Not too shabby. It's getting them out of there. They're not all coming out perfect like that. I almost think it doesn't have to actually matter because if we build like a we lead in all. into the fixture. Or you could build the fixture open and then have pneumatics that kick it into the, you know, kick the corner, center it. That's the one, the nice thing. That it, yeah, that's my thought is we build like a lead interior, in into yeah. the fixture, then we can use some pneumatics to clamp it in place and drag down the box use the uh, out. yeah use the weight of the object to kind of slip it into the pocket and then center it with pneumatics my only concern is if we pull one out and everything shifts <laughs> yeah that's possible Station one, second level. How bad was it to get the uh, oddball start from the center? Or, uh, looping? Oh, I just had to move some waypoints around. Easy. I'm just be stoked if it empties this whole box <laughs> as much time as we spent on it. Pretty awesome. I should be able to make it faster too. I just didn't yeah. change the speed settings, but I was gonna say full power, Scotty. Video is going to take forever to upload. It's already a four minute video. You might be able to scrub it into fast mode and recompile it so that. I don't think it'll matter. I mean, really, it's like. I don't think they need it to be fast because they're basically. The I'm operator about gets. You might be able to speed up the video when you send it to them. Oh like, yeah. Yeah. That's do true. the first half like normal speed, and then just like scrub through it. Yeah, that's a good idea. How many times I'm gonna forget? Yeah, is this gonna be a on? Uh, that's probably gonna be on request. On request, push a so button. Push a button. It, yep. 
loads it onto a fixture and then the operator starts assembling everything on it. And then uh, hanging up on the box a little bit there. Yeah, but it didn't stop the robot though. Nope. So the... Move this tubing out of the way. Uh -oh. uh oh. Forgot to. Takes off where it left off. I knew that was going to happen eventually. <laughs> You glazed over watching it too much. I know. Oh, that one came out quick. I like that we went to the corners because it really forces the whole thing to kind of correct itself. Yep. It's about to do it again. <laughs> Get it out of there quick! We can extend that thing too, so there's not. Yeah, because it hang, keeps it, it, it hangs up on. anywhere. It hangs up on the on the screw at the top. Yeah, we can we can take that out of the. We can extend it. I just didn't want. I wanted to clear. So I wanted to make sure that we were all good. Still got it. Yeah, because I mean, you're going to the midpoint. There's enough wiggle room on the center point of these things. Yeah. That I think that helps us. Is there one more layer after this? Is there four? Then there's two. further down they get I think the more stable the position is going to become too yeah the tops are the worst I think you're right there is two more layers You know, the problem we're gonna have, Greg, is that we're we're gonna have to build uh, an extension for that gripper because it's not gonna be long enough, or we have to extend the tooling because it's not gonna be long enough before That's the robot arm can... starts hitting the box, which is fine. Yeah, that that the arm. Yeah, but this, it's this guy consistent enough. I'm pretty pretty confident. It seems to work really well. I'm surprised. It's gonna be a close thing though. It might be by a level, a layer. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're gonna be one layer short. We could extend the R, the. You just do a tool extender, or we could we can machine the fingers and actually just make them longer. Yeah. Exactly. <clears throat>
I think I could speed up a lot of it, but I think the outside corners are the ones that you don't want to go too fast because they're mm -hmm. too likely to hang up on the edge of the box. And the faster yeah. you go, the more likely, the more likely they're going to be higher force input. Yep. Now I'm causing her to watch fall You out. might be able to, in those positions, you might be able to. Even this move is really slow. I don't know why. As you come so up, slow. come away from the wall of the. Be real close to get that second to last layer. And the last one's gonna be a little too deep, but that's right. I think it gets the point across the fact that I just emptied this whole box. Mm -hmm. Very, very promising. I'm, I'm, I'm really pleased with the I mean, right out of the box, it's this consistent. Yep. No pun intended. Right out of the box. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Engineering jokes. Problem. 